Hello there, this is Amy from Made for Math, and I'm here today to talk to you about subtraction using expanded form and base 10 blocks. Let's go ahead and get started. The first problem I'm going to model is 25 minus 19. I'm just going to go ahead and put this right here. And what I'm going to do first is I'm going to break up 25. The first way that I'm going to break 25 up into what it's made of. So one way that I can break up 25, there are a bunch of different ways I can break up 25, but one way that comes to mind is 20 plus five. Go ahead and write that right here. And then I'm gonna go ahead and break up 19. And one way that I can break up 19 is 10 plus nine. Well, I'm just gonna write that right underneath there. And then I'm going to go ahead and make a model for 25. So I had 20. 10 plus 10 is 20. And then I have five ones. Have to move that down a little. Okay, so here's my model of 20 plus 5, which equals 25. Mm -hmm. Now, if I want to take away 19, I am going to start with taking away 9 ones right here from the 5 ones. The only thing I run into is I only have 5 ones. So in order to do this, I would have to take one of my 10s and I would have to break it into ones and I would have to get into something called regrouping. Now I could do that, but I'm actually gonna show you another way. And we're gonna be using numbers flexibly. So Joe Bowler has mentioned um, that it's important for kids to be able to interact with numbers with flexibility. So what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna break up this 25 in another way. And let me show you. So I'm going to go ahead and rewrite the 25 minus 19. And instead of breaking up 25 into 20 plus 5, I'm going to break up 25 into 10 plus 10 plus 5. And I know that 10 plus 10 is 20 plus another 5 is 25. So either way I break up the number, I still have the number 25. And that's an example of just using numbers flexibly. And I'm gonna go ahead and leave the 19 the same. I'm gonna break it up the same way that I did previously. And that is 10 plus nine. Okay. And I'm just gonna write this right under here. So I'm gonna draw this line almost as you would see in a traditional subtraction problem. So what I'm gonna do now is when I break up that 25, I'm going to have a 10 here, a 10 here, and a 5, similar to what I had before with my 20 plus 5. Okay, so right here I have a 10 plus another 10 plus 5. Okay, so now I'm going to do things slightly different. And I'm actually going to leave this five ones that I have right here, right here. I'm just gonna leave those five ones there. I'm actually not gonna do anything with the five ones. Okay. What I'm gonna do first after that is I'm gonna take this nine from my 19 right here. And I'm gonna take nine from this first group of 10 right here. So I'm gonna need to take this 10 and I just need to break it up into ones in order to take nine away. So first I'm just gonna start by taking eight away and then there we go, I've taken nine away. So now actually instead of 10, I just have one left right here. And I'm gonna go ahead and write that down here. And so I have 10 minus nine, which is one. Okay. And then I need to take 10 from the 19 away from one of the 10s from the 25. 
So I'm actually going to click on this tag and I'm gonna delete it and now it's gone. So I'm gonna erase that. And I don't have any tens, 10 minus 10 is zero. And I'm gonna go ahead and add back what I have for my answer. So one plus five equals six. And here I have zero plus one plus five is six. So 25 minus 19 equals six. So in this model, I didn't have to worry about regrouping. Um, I, all I did was I just practiced using these numbers flexibly. And instead of having 25 be, oops, that looks a little sloppy, uh, 20 plus five, I went ahead and changed that to 10 plus 10 plus five. That way, this nine would work well with this second group of 10 here, and I wouldn't have to worry about these five ones. I could have chose lots of other examples. This is just the one I chose. Thank you for joining me. That was subtraction using expanded form, uh, interacting with numbers flexibly, and base 10 blocks.